Hi, praise the Lord. My name is Pastor Albert Enchiopoku, a member of HSM Drama Ministry. Please, this movie you are about to watch is for the purpose of winning souls to sustain us, maintain us in Christ for godly and holy living. Prepare us for rapture. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel, like it, share, and drop your comment. The Lord be with you and keep you till we meet again. Bye. I must tell you the truth. This vision worth a million cities in the electoral market and about 200 additional members to our current number if we let it out. What is going on, dear? Nothing, nothing. Why should you allow this pig farm machine to cause uh, disturbances or distraction in this house? Well, there are other important things to attend to. Eh. Yeah. If this is useless, then there is something else that is more important. Things are not moving as we predicted. Um, but all hope is not lost. I believe when you win the flag bearer ship, we must reform to the, the campaign team to boost our votes. You are right. Because it is a must win. Yes, sir. Well, that's true. But who is going to take care of the mess if there is any? Any unforeseen thing is going to cost me and the station a lot since the pastor in charge is not well known. The game is about to begin. The prophet of the ballot. <laughs> I believe this is exactly what you have been expecting. Mabwa. Grace, why do you want to hinder the flow of the Holy Spirit? Huh? The church is now spreading like wildfire. Uh, and I believe this is the time. The move that brings souls, financial breakthrough, and the spread of the gospel. Honey, so how long will you be able to hold on to what you have gotten yourself, your family, and the entire church into? Eh? How long? 
my dear, so far as we are in this together, by you supporting me in prayer, in the matters surrounding the election, and other things concerning the nation, the Lord is ready to bring out the vision. Police! Prophet ballot books, ah! paper, pink sheet, or whatever it is that they are calling you by. Count me out of this evil and ungodliness. If I have any prayer to pray for the nation, I will do it as the Bible says. I wish you well. Excuse me. Hey, woman. You wait. When the politicians begin to purchase our goods and the money begins to flow, you will join. I know you will join. Ah, which woman doesn't like money on this earth? I know me. I'm a rich man now. Money begins to flow. Ah, Pastor, time will tell. Time will definitely tell. Grace, you will join me. Sir, this victory is one of a kind. Very true. It must be victory ordained by God from above. <sighs> Talking about ordained uh, by God, <sighs> I think we need to get in touch uh, with that prophet from uh, Breath of Christ uh, Bible Church, who gave us the numbers uh, to work with before any other person gets hold of him. Oh, sir, don't worry. I have everything under control. I've already spoken to his elder who brought him for the TV interview and I've arranged for an appointment for us to meet with him. Great. ASV! Victory! 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 victory. Pastor was giving me some different types of names. I'm throwing dragons on TV. Ah, why is the holy church like this sudden? Why are you acting as if Pastor is doing something out of nowhere? Or oh, the church is acting outside the Bible. I think you need to make time and study the word of God concerning what is doing. Well, I may not know a lot in the Bible, but I don't feel well about this. I think he was just showing off. And this does not add anything to the edification of the church. If you don't know, then keep quiet. Your feeling doesn't count in Christianity. Of what the Bible say. As for me, I'm ready to support and stand by them anytime because of this new move. So are you supporting them because of your knowledge in the word of God? I haven't read the Bible up to the place of election, prophecy, and even things found in it. I believe he had deeper insight in what he's doing and is going to help the church. So you haven't also read there? Come to think of it, do you know the consequences of concealing God's vision? Please, let's allow him what to do what's right and we will all benefit from it. Kill. God is in control. Amen. Sir, congratulations. Thank you. But why are you congratulating me? Sir, we've hit the jackpot. I just received a call from ASP candidates you prophesied about. They are ready to meet us for negotiations. So soon? Wow, that is awesome. I never expected things to work out this way. God is at work. In fact, the chairman promised to place you 
on their campaign team. And this automatically comes with huge allowances and other special benefits for you and the church. Okay, then we need to act fast before any constraints or dis disappointments. Quick action is necessary now. Oh, thank for everything. I'm very grateful. Sir, you are always welcome. I will get in touch with you tomorrow. Wow, something good is about to happen. Something good is about to happen. Uh, Daddy, awesome. what's making you happy like this? Chacha, our God is faithful. Something good is going to happen in our lives. Money is on its way coming. Money is coming. Amen. Wait, Daddy, this means you will pay my school fees before we start exam. Sure. And very soon, you'll be able to pay the landlord as well. Yes, I'm going to do that and many others. Very soon, we might move from this house and we'll be able to even change our ancient car. Let's go before you get late. Thank you, God bless. Ah, that's I'm my daughter. I'm very glad to hear that. Let's go before you get late. Lines. It's not going to. Wait, wait, the networks are really giving us problem, and I'm very sure it will be a network issue. All right, no problem. I'll keep on trying. But then, since you want to go, um, can you leave a message behind so that when Pastor comes, I'll relay it to him? Okay, that wouldn't be a problem. Um, the church presbytery have decided to uh, meet Pastor on Thursday. Yeah, meeting. Why? I, I hope all is well. Oh, mommy, everything is well. Um, we just want to discuss something very important about the church with daddy. Okay. At least that gives my heart some sort of relief. I thank God that it's nothing serious. It is well. Mm? Thank you so much for coming. Then I will be heading out. Okay, no problem. Let me see you. Okay. By the way, how is your wife? Uh, Mommy, please, you're doing well. Thank you. <laughs> please extend my greetings to her when you go. Okay. okay. something for you oh not really uh, i just wanted to ask uh, what do you think about what the leaders call oh grace why do you have to bother my head about them listen i'm the head of the church and i don't need to meet them hmm? but for the sake of respect you i'll, I'll honor it okay me change you are saying it grace I'm the same person here. I just hope that their meeting is not about present incidents. Please cut it. You people just stop conjuring something out of nothing. Ah, I'm ahead of the church of grace. Know that. You can't be teaching me. Yo. Pastor. I believe you are surprised about this meeting. But trust me, it is for a good cause. Thank you, sir. People like you wouldn't call anybody without a reason. I'm ready, sir. I'm ready. Well, uh, I saw your interview prior to our internal elections, uh, which really helped me in securing a uh, my place as a flag bearer once again to stand in for uh, my party. And so after studying the interview and uh, considering so many things, without wasting much time, I decided with my team to uh, employ you to work for us. Hmm. Sir, I am honored. 
and I'm willing to work with you. In that effect, your work is to ensure uh, my victory in the general election, both physically and spiritually. Sorry, sir. If I may ask, how do I come in, in this area? Well, you know, we need to come out with very strong and convincing prophecies. That will generate uh, public attraction for my candidature and also my spiritual fortification. And then I'm ready to do that. <laughs> In that case, um, you shall be given uh, 50,000 Ghana cities as your monthly uh, allowance. A car and also um, 5 million Ghana cities to make any preparations necessary to ensure my victory, both physically and spiritually, in these upcoming elections. I mean, the general elections. Sir, did you say 50,000? 5 million Ghana cities? Ah, sir, God bless you. God bless you. In fact, you win this election in Jesus' name. Amen. Spiritually, you are the president. Amen. But, please, this is very important to me. If I don't win this election, you have to refund my five million Ghana cities, which the party is going to allocate to you. And every other incentive you are enjoying. Sir, nothing unfortunate would ever happen. In fact, my God has revealed everything to me. In that case, then um, you're on a good course. I believe you can close to that. To a great victory. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Ah, sir, what is it? What is it? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Pastor. <laughs> uh, such meetings, you know, come with a little bit of alcohol. You need to adjust to it. <laughs> no, but I don't drink alcohol. Say, you are not drinking. It's just for the moment of celebration. Apostles has defeated the evil one and the angels. You were fighting and destroyed him, and I was there looking. Ah, and I said, Angels, I don't hurt you. Ah, it was a very nice thing to be good. It was lazy. <laughs> and you drunk? Ah, yes, oh. It was just a little wine I took uh, to celebrate after the meeting. <laughs> and it was fine, Grace. Ah, yes. You are rich. You will see money. Five million. Fifty thousand. Just on the tips of my finger. You are rich. <laughs> Fifty thousand. Five million. Money. Money. Are you alright? I'm very fine. Very soon you shall be rich. Five million. Yes, we are. We are rich. Five million Ghana cities. Elder Sam, but how could you people do that? Eh? Is that how you are turning the church of God? 
Mommy, I don't understand what's going on here. Eh, you don't understand. Now let me make things clear to you. How could leaders of the church have a meeting and serve alcoholic beverages? Is that not Satanism? Is that not Satanism? But mommy, how on earth could we do such a thing? So are you telling me that my husband, the pastor, is a liar? But where did he get that information? Because he did not have our invitation. We waited for him and he never showed up. Are you saying that my husband did not attend the meeting? Yes, ma. Is, is, is everything okay? Where did my husband go yesterday? I'm going to Ma. Please, are you okay? Yes, yes, I'm okay, I'm fine. Oh. I think there's a miscommunication somewhere. But okay. I have to go now. Okay, please, mommy. I'll see you around. Okay, please, mommy. husband you need to explain what is going on in this house explanation to what Chris huh? is something going on in this house yes a lot a lot you left this house with us thinking you were going to a leaders meeting but you did not you came back drunk so sad Robert please I demand an answer now with the leaders meeting I had a more important meeting which aimed at progressing the church and it happened to be at the same time that is why I couldn't honor the meeting my dear you mean you absented yourself from leaders meeting to another that you think is more important this is ridiculous totally absurd at least you could have told them something but instead, you kept the elderly people waiting. What good has those so-called elders done for the church for the past years? Dear, there are more important things to talk about than these elders who can never think of anything better in times of difficulties. Ah! So-called elders? Hmm. Anyway, what called for the drinking yesterday? this for that it wasn't intentional i mistakenly took someone's drink and later i was told the drink contains alcohol i didn't know what to do because i'm not used to it a little sip got me drunk dear you know what i have a good news for you mm. and what is it the flag bearer of the asb party has promised to put me on his payroll. I will be receiving 50,000 Ghana cities every month just for the Lord using me to help him win the, the Congress. And do you know what? He further promised 5 million Ghana cities. I hope he 5 million Ghana cities if I help him win the election. Really? Yes. And what was your response? Ah, Grace, when is I know you all? Yes, of course. Honey, did you pray about it before giving him the answer? Eh? I believe you were employed by God. And so if someone else needs your assistance in any way, you have to seek permission from him first. <laughs> On the contrary, my dear. There's no time for that at this moment. We are about to reap our long-awaited answers to the progress of the church in our lives. And do you think that these benefits from the politicians, who is not in any way interested in your work, but rather the revelation, 
are the answers to your prayers? Grace, you need to know that many people help the ministry of Jesus Christ go on without being believers. And ours is not exceptional. We need to channel much prayer into it to receive more direction for them on how to win the election and our lives will be transformed forever. Have you forgotten Cyrus in the Bible and how he helped the Jews without seeking God? Honey, please, I beg you, let's take time with this. Because these politicians, eh, most of them are dangerous. Dangerous. Grace, the Lord is on our side. And he will never leave or forsake us. In fact, nothing by any means shall harm us. We are safe. Don't worry. Can't worry, cry on you. Can't worry. Honey, do not say I did not warn you when the day comes. Why? Thank you. You are always warning me. Have to wait. Hey, Akoto, what a surprise visit early this morning. Oh, my bam, area more happy than that, my cabby. Now, my home watch and I'm sending you a fire and I'm a babbage. I don't know if you said you are not here. That's kind of you. Last Saturday, I chanced on you at the Shapini's funeral, but I couldn't make time to chat with you because of the crowd. Don't worry about that. Hope everything is fine. By God's grace, everything is good. That's good. But I would be me me have me home with South CC as I want to say because we so for now what's too fear no trendy and what trendy would TV so no Ghana had your wajib baby yeah. Abdul, stop the jokes. We are not children anymore to be playing such matters. No 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 no. I am telling you the truth. I am not a joke. CC no, I'm on your phone. We show we move come back here. A bit more crazy, it can be thousands of. Me cry me who how I mean most can you drink? Just say thousands of. Just say a yes, it can move drunk. As I'm so maybe I can. And today they say ah, they mean you have been making me say we need problem cry. We suffer with it for sure. Come say say they are one of politicians and they are dealing with wajib baby. I want trend. They are Ghana hand kasa hand kasa. And today they are only problem cry. Hey, what they are you? What they are you? I mean you have been my. I can't want money be. This is news to me. But if what you are saying is true, then this man must pay me my money today. Akuto, mami, mami, I can't come for you, Sika. Trusting God, rather in man. If our ways are in His hands, He direct our path. Why don't you trust in God? If our ways are in His hands, He the earth apart. Oh, as faithful is He, God has promised He will do it. He can never fail. As faithful is He, God has called us. He's for sure. He can never lie. As faithful is He. It is complete. But this is the arrears. When do I return for the prepayment of the upcoming months? Landlord, please, God bless you for everything. Your encouragement, your support, and your advice to us. But <laughs> we have found a befitting place for our work. So next week, Monday by now, we will be leaving to our new place. Dear. So, uh, save your breath. I understand everything. This place is now below your status. You can hand over the keys to me peacefully. You can go to your refitting place, Mr. Political Prophet. It is in this very room that you had your visions. God bless you. Papa Landlord, please don't get us wrong. We didn't mean it like that. So, mommy, there's no need for that. You can hand over the keys to me by Monday when you are ready to leave. Thank you. Dear, don't 
those comments to him were uncalled for. Eh? Besides, you told me we are leaving this place for another. But you never mentioned that we have gotten the money to pay for the rent for the new place. Grace, so do I have to tell you everything in this house as a leader? Ah, huh? In fact, I've received my monthly allowance as a member of the campaign team of the ASP party. And they have rented a new apartment for us. For information, that is where we are moving into next week. Honey, are you sure you are okay? Please, have you thought about the consequences of your engagement with this political party? Please, I beg you, take it slow. Don't rush. Eh? The Bible says, Godliness with contentment is great gain. Grace. Put a stop to this nonsense. Why are you painting me as a devil in this house? Huh? And what is wrong with your pastor involving in politics? Huh? So you, you want to tell me that you are content with what you are going on in this house, eh? Please don't worry. It is clear we have read many articles on how politics and elections have robbed many nations of their peace, joy, inhabitations, taking innocent lives. We must pray, brethren. How many people are refugees in other countries? We have to pray that God should intervene Amen. in this election and grant us peaceful elections. Amen. May we pray that God should choose a good leader for us in Jesus' name. Amen. I don't mean to direct you as the leader, but I believe and I think that the latter part of your prayer point should be straightened, if possible. What do you think, brethren? My sister, please, what do you mean by that? Mm. Are you a stranger in Jerusalem? Ask them for me. Our pastor has already declared whom the Lord has chosen, and we must stick to that. Let us pray that what the Lord has revealed will be established yes. to bring glory to the church and to our pastor. Exactly. Yeah. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Please, my sister. Although the pastor has said that, but I do not support it. I do not support that ASB should come to power. We all know the economic crisis we went through before the exit. Never again. Ah, my sister, you are right. Never again would they ascend the throne to rule this nation. Yes, you people are just exhibiting your ignorance and idiocy. Is this government free from corruption and bribery scandals? Whether you like it or not, the ASP must come to power. And we, as a church, will support them with our power, with our blood, with everything that we have, and nobody can stop that. But brethren, brethren, let us not change the purpose of our gathering. We are here to pray. Yeah. What are you talking about? Ah, we are here to pray. Did you just say pray? Yes. But did you listen to our trance? This stomach direction Christian <clears throat> and an illiterate party food soldier <laughs> just insulted us. She called us ignorant people. But why do you have to come and steal me instead of calling? You should have called. Say, there is fire that we need to extinguish before it consumes us. Please kindly go straight to the point. You always speak in parables. The other leaders have conjured to make your seat vacant if you don't act fast. What? For what reason? Don't you know, there is a scheduled meeting regarding your current political trend. In this church? Okay, we shall see. We shall see who the real leader of this church is. We shall see these people on seat me. Okay, we shall see. By the grace of God, 
we are witnessing a tremendous increase in our members as well as our finances of late. But, but what? Oh, oh. Ada, please, allow him to Ada, Sam, please continue. Thank you, sir. But the avenue from which the increase is coming is a little bit problematic. And we, the elders of the church, are very concerned about it. And what avenue are you talking about? And what is the problem with it, if I may know? Pastor, I think the church is going far in mingling ourselves with politics, especially taking a stand with one party. And what is wrong about that? Ask him, Pastor. Elder Sam, why are you trying to be holier than that? Why do you always try to stand against any door that will bring benefit to us? Please, I don't mean to stand against anything that is good. Please shut up and let me talk. I am the most elderly amongst you all. And if I'm talking, you must pave way. Being part of us does not mean you can advise us. Ma, I am very sorry if I offended you in any way. But ma, are you not the same person? Who has me as the secretary to arrange for this meeting to demand answers from pastor? Ma, I, I, why are you behaving this way now? No one ordered you. It was your own decision. We even ordered you to stop it. But because of your stubbornness, you did not listen. <laughs> Brethren, I don't think there should be any argument between us as leaders. The pastor is here. He will speak for himself. Thank you very much, Adavika. My elders, I, as the head of this family, I want to apologize to you all for what I did. In fact, I was supposed to explain certain things to you before taking some decisions that I took. In fact, I don't want to sway from the church's vision. We are on the path to our prosperity and breakthrough. The election year is beneficiary to all. And we as a church, need to have our share. Ah, I was led by the Spirit of God to take that decision and all what I did. And that is all. So if anyone amongst you do not want to go by that way and not to pray by the ASP party to win this election, that person can decide to stop being a member of the church. And that is final. That is all. And that is my stand. I rest my case. Thank you. Just go. Just go. Adabeka, <laughs> how did you do it? I used their own sword to kill them. Let's get back to work. Yes. I believe that 5 million Ghana cities will be deposited into our account very soon. Oh, that's good. That is what his accountant told me. Ada, thank you very much for pushing me into this light. Amen. Amen. <sighs> you know, I am always at your service. Oh, that's good. Ada, Becca. <laughs> you. What is going on in the church? Are we not to bring people from darkness into the light? But why are we rather joining the works of darkness? Or am I overreacting? 
over the meeting. Mm. I still can't get a scene out of my mind. As if I'm watching a movie. How the elders were able to switch away from their convictions just after some few days. I think something is wrong somewhere. Auntie, you are not far from right. But how can the church go back to what we detest? Lord, <sighs> what is happening in your church? Which among the seven churches in Minor Asia will you liken us to if you are to write to us again? Dear, what are we going to do now? Uh, I don't know. I am totally lost. I don't know. Then I will suggest we wait upon the Lord for his directives. Yeah, yeah. That's very, very important. You are very right. Mm -hmm. I had a dream. Mm. What was the dream? In the dream, I saw daddy among some people drinking in one blood. Jeez. Promise, he will do it. Cause 